Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to use Snapchat. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open the Snapchat app just like that. Now in this video tutorial I will not be going over the signing up process or the process for logging in um, but this tutorial will be strictly focused on how to use Snapchat once you are already logged into the app. So basically as you can see right here there are three main screens. You can see at the bottom one, two, three and I will be going over each of those screens and how to use the features on each of the screens. Now just first and foremost you can actually swipe between the screens by swiping left and right. So you can see you can just scroll between the screens just like that by swiping left and right, okay? So let's start off with the leftmost screen. So if you swipe, uh, if you go to the leftmost screen, you can either swipe there or just push it just like that. This is basically your chat screen. This shows all of the chats that you have received and all of the chats that you have sent. It shows all of, all of the snaps that you have received and all of the snaps that you have sent, okay? Now you can go ahead and you can see who has opened, um, who has opened the snaps and when they were delivered and so forth. It shows all, the inf all of the information um, beneath each name. Now if you, want to in if you want to interact with someone on this screen, you can simply swipe right Right, and you can you can chat with them so I can just let's say I wanted to interact with this person I can swipe swipe right and I can type uh, a message over here and I can send a chat okay I'm just gonna go uh, back to the previous screen if you want to send a new chat you can click this button on the top left corner right here and you can choose who you want to send the chat to so it says chat with you can select the person that you want to send the chat to I'm just going to go back to the previous screen and there's also this button on the top right over here but I will be going over that um, in a few moments okay so now let's go to the middle screen you can either click that middle button over there or you can swipe to get to the middle screen so now we're on the middle screen this is basically the camera screen now I'm just going to swipe back just for one second so I'm going to go back to the leftmost chat screen if you click this button on the top right corner that will actually bring you to the camera screen as well. So you can see that now it's just making use of my camera. There's my, my hand in front of the camera, just as you can see right there. So I'm just going to put my hand in front of the camera so you can see those icons a little bit better up there. So there are a few things that you can do on this screen. The, up at the, sorry about that, I'm just trying to give you the best angle. I'll just hold my hand in front of the camera. So up on the top left over there, that alters, alternates the flash on and off. This button right here, if you click this little icon over there, um, that basically shows your profile information and you can add friends, see who added you and so forth, okay? I'm just going to get rid of that. And then over here on the top right, that changes the camera viewing angle, okay? So let's just say that you wanted to take uh, a, a picture. Um, let's just go ahead, I'm just going to bring my camera case in front of me right there. You can actually click the button to take a picture or you can hold it down and I'm talking about this button down here in the middle bottom middle you can click it to take a picture or you can hold it down to take a video let's take a picture of this right here so I'm gonna click it it took the picture and now I can actually send this picture so there are uh, once again a few options and, and unfortunately it's kinda hard to see I'm just gonna try it one more time so I can get um, some coloration so you can see the options so I'm gonna turn the camera case like this and I'm gonna take the picture just like that so now that I've taken the picture I'll show you the options so with this button right here you can basically add some stickers you can add any of these stickers just click the sticker and you can move it around you can also add text with that button right there okay and you can draw on the picture with that button right over there and uh, basically um, you can also just go back from this screen just by clicking the X and that will remove the picture. I'm just going to take the picture one more time just to show you uh, just to show you what uh, the, the other options are. So down here you have a timer and the timer basically allows you to choose how long you want the picture to, to, be, uh, to be viewed for. So you can change the number of seconds. You can click this button right here to save the picture. So I'll click it just like that. You can see that it saved the picture. Um, and then you can click this button over here to add the picture to your story. So if you click that button, you can add the picture to your story. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to click the cancel button 
Um, and then you can click this button to send the picture. So you can see all of the options and I can go ahead and choose who I want to send this picture to. Just like that, okay? Um, also, if you change the camera to the rear facing camera, um, I'll just change it just for a quick second. You can see my camera right there. Um, you can actually press and hold down on your face and it will give you a whole bunch of options um, with regards to cool things that you can do with your face, different filters and so forth. Um, but I'm not going to do that right now because you can't see my face because the camera's there. But you can press and hold down on your face and it will give you a variety of options. Also, one more quick thing. Um, when you take a picture, I'm just going to go ahead and take a picture of this camera case again. When you take a picture, you can swipe from side to side and it gives you all different filters that you can use. So you can use all different filters, just as you can see right there. And you can, you know, have all different things overlapping over the picture. The last screen that I want to show you is the rightmost screen. This is basically the story screen. And this just basically shows you all of the stories of all of your friends stories and if you had any stories that you have posted they will be accessible at the top. There are also all of these um, different stories that you can check out over here from various other, uh, other uh, accounts and so forth. And that's basically it. It is really, really simple. Um, it is a very, very simple process and in this video I have shown you how to use Snapchat. It's really easy to use and once again I haven't covered how to sign up for Snapchat or how to log in. Instead I have covered how to use Snapchat once you have already signed up and logged in. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.